भलोमंद चैलेंजेस जब मार्केट और any other uh, situation so i'm sharing a very three uh, slides here um, so that you know uh, um, i just i will just talk about the very basic of um, soft skill versus the hard skills uh, just i'm sharing on a screen uh, it will be a, uh, giving you a very uh, brief idea so that um you can work on it at you know whenever um, you are uh, in university um level of education or any level and, and even even if you are uh, in corporate level so you need to know what is your uh, hard skills and soft skills so i'm taking a uh, like a uh, little bit of time of um, explaining then hard and soft Uh, as you can see probably uh, from the screen then hard skills versus soft skills so hard skills are technical uh, knowledge or training that you have gained through the many life experiences uh, including in your career or education so actually we are learning every day we are experiencing every day so the thing is that uh, our learning will never end till death so every day we are learning something else so what i used to say in my class that whatever the lesson you learn today uh, if you feel that that lesson will uh, be valuable for future uh, situations um, uh, you could uh, use this experience um, for uh, dealing that the same thing in a better way say you are dealing a person today you did some gross mistake then okay uh next time you will not do that so uh in that case uh so just you can see that then what is the hard skills then what is the soft skills uh there is some examples say hard skills means like if you have like a linguistic uh you know knowledge say english or spanish french bengali even if you're working in bangladesh and there are so many regions so many like chitangan people are speaking in a different tone than the silet peoples or northali peoples or kumilla or some other so you have to learn the things so that if 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 you are dealing in like a chitangan people or if you're dealing in northali people so that you might get a little bit of advantage if you have a have this tone uh, because people are uh feeling easy whenever they are speaking um uh, yeah, like in their mother tongue so that's the things then you have to think about so you need to know about the data wage management so like you have to have any skills say say uh, we, we are dealing like always keep the data wages whom you are going to meet and whom you have met then why you met them and do you want to meet them again i meet them again so why because it is very very important for you uh, whether you will proceed on uh, with the uh, uh, with these people once again 
Uh, will it be viable for you? Will it be feasible for you? So you need to know how to manage the database. It could be done through so many ways, especially the Excel is a very powerful program. Then you need to learn Excel, advanced Excel then, and it's a very powerful program, I can tell you. So develop your um, develop your skill in Excel. And like so many people think, oh, oh, the Excel is not a big deal for me. Oh, it's like the summation divisions or some other things, no. Uh, it's, it's a really very powerful program. It could be done so many ways. Uh, it can it have a lot of lot of lot of options, a uh, lot of um, add-ons. So you need to learn. And another things uh, like the Adobe. Uh, Adobe they they, they have uh, so many uh, a few applications um, which is the popular is like um, uh, especially the the PDF versions. So you need to do uh, you do good use of how to develop a good PDF and all this. And you need to learn network security because today's era is a, like a, um, in a computer digitalization. So you need to understand how to network through this digital process. Yeah, and then you need to learn what is the security system and uh, how far you can do, how far you cannot do. And there are so many in the list on SEO or SEM marketing and statistical analysis. And these are the things is like a little bit of upper level. You cannot do it in one day or one month. Say that because the, the question asked by the office or the first year student and very fresh, then you will have like a four years to go in, in your graduation time. So you have to develop uh, these things on, but you have to can. Uh, okay, uh, you can you can you can you can split it like this. Say, okay, next three months I'll learn um, Excel, and you have to devote on the Excel. You cannot take everything in your uh, like a plate, and then so that what will happen if you take biryani, if you like a white rice, and if you have a, like a curries and so many curries, you cannot digest it. Okay, like this. So you have to finish one by one. Once at a time, will give you the quality education. And there are so many things uh, that if anything, user interface, little bit of uh, well, um, like uh, uh, the, the Photoshop's or some other skills you can develop in there yourself. And then there are so many programs you'll find, uh, Udemy or uh, Coursera or some other. And if you looked at the LinkedIn, and if you follow the, the good peoples in LinkedIn, uh, like uh, the professional people in LinkedIn, then uh, you, you you will have a tremendous tremendous um, uh, opportunity to learn uh, by seeing their profile and then what kind of uh, skills they have. And there are so many people, so many people. I'm nothing uh, on compared to them. Uh, so they, they they are giving you know, the delivery of uh, for to, to these students then how to develop yourself. And it is the time because you could earn a lot of money. I think uh, your senior brothers or sisters, um, uh, um, you will find in your department that, or university, that some people are working for um, the software industry in USA or European um, countries, and they are earning a handsome amount of money. And search engine optimizations, uh, SEO, and this is the very uh, beautiful things. And you can earn a lot of money. It will not start with a lot of money. Maybe it will start with like a 500 bucks or one dollar, two dollar, and one day it will grow big. It will, if nothing, there is no shortcut way. As an always, I used to say, there is no shortcut way. So. Try to uh, focus on the programming. If you are focusing on like accounting or some other things, you might have like a Python or some other things or SAP or some other things or simulation model. And and actually it depends on what you are focusing. If you're focusing on specific marketing or within the marketing, then you know, you're focusing branding or advertising or um, some other things. So. Uh, I think it depends on the things you are going to choose and then and then your skills will focus on. You should not say you are in marketing and you choose, this, uh, choose to stick on sales and you should not learn so many things about advertising, branding and all this. So you have to stick on the sales. 
and you might have a, like a um, second choice and that is the different things okay if you uh, want to like have a little bit of interest in advertising and more interest on branding so you could have like a, a minor and major type things so a little bit of so that means so what we learned here very briefly hard skills is like a technical knowledge the certification is not important uh, uh, every now and then. So, but the things learned, because I personally never had a, like a go for cert certification. I learned C plus by myself, by reading books. Uh, I learned so many uh, applications. I forgot so many like Excel. And so these are the um, Excel, you know, um, or what is called um, uh, so many internet based application uh, in, my, in, in my student life by reading books and we don't we didn't have a google uh, that time so we have to rely on some books and then we have to go one by one and then finish the job uh, accordingly so at the same time if you have acquired a lot of um, hard skills but you know you have to deliver them you have to communicate your hard skill with the your uh, subordinate your bosses or uh, or your friends or families or your co-workers uh, efficiently so to do so then you need to learn soft skills as well so people often forget and they think okay i learned so many applications i learned so many things so it will uh, I, I will be champion in my workplace actually uh, it will not happen all the time what you have to do actually you have to know then uh, then what is the soft skill will help you to you know um, you know communicate your hard skills to with your co-workers or your team members so that is the thing so you have to know what is integrity what is the ethical viewpoints what is the dependability how dependability could be used who is dependent on you who whom you are dependent so then you have to communicate with them appropriately through your hard skills and effective communication is very important. You have a like a course of communication. I do like to request you learn as much as you can in the communication courses. It is very important. You have to learn how to communicate, how to do the effective communication, when communication can be done, when communication, um, uh, you know, is, in, is not in action, so though you have tried. So effective communication is very important and open-mindedness and it is very important uh, in our country you often see i often write in my facebook uh, that people are so you know, miser like okay if you learn something he will not give you he or she will not give you right away okay and even he knows or she knows but um, they will not talk you straight away there are so many reasons of doing that anyway i'm not going on it but do your own thing so whenever like you learn something, whenever you are trying to express the same, same learning to the other people, and then you will find there is a difficulty because um, open-mindedness will give you the more learning. Don't forget about, okay, I learned this, uh, uh, having like a spending like a one year time. Why should I give you within a, like a one minute? Yes, you might have like a, some punch uh, no, uh, line knowledge and uh, you can keep it a secret but the general things which may people earn it uh, today or tomorrow then you should um, you know share it to the people or well, show the openness believe me you will not be loser ethically or religiously I believe that whenever you know something you try to uh, express these things to the other people and believe me it, it will work on you uh, teamwork uh, is very many you need to know them uh, in our country uh, one of the leggings i work in so many places that people has a, um, a very uh, a common uh, you know uh, what is called they have loopholes that they cannot communicate with the people uh, they don't know what is the teamwork you cannot do everything uh, by your own so you are working as a team then you have to think that every team member um, uh, is very important every team member is very important so you need to know the why team members are important and because the team without team members you cannot accomplish a job so then you need to know then what is teamwork how to uh, evaluate your team members how to use your team members how to be part of a team so that is the things 
and all this thing uh, uh, the next one is creativity right so we have to know then what is creativity so you have to deliver something creative not like okay uh, you jump out uh, every second and, and tell and telling everybody oh i found something uh, good it is not happening to show your creativity you have to think yourself for a while then you have to evaluate those thinking whether it is a rational or valid or something and you have to evaluate these things you have to analyze these things and then you can tell okay and then oh this is a creative idea this could be even uh, you delivered this creative idea maybe your team members may not accept it don't be disheartened and this is the process of learning so one day you will know then actually which one is the creative one which one is the innovative one uh, in our country another thing is that people often is actually the problem creator not the problem solver and you see the our facebook writing and then we mentioning so many problems okay and then okay why didn't do it uh, why the people didn't do it why government didn't do it and blah 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 why my teachers didn't do it why my colleagues didn't do it why my friend didn't do it what you did and so actually the problem solving then you, you got a problem you, you will think about the problem then you have to find out some solutions okay you can propose your solution maybe your surroundings may not accept you but again try your best to give you like a little bit of solutions whether you're asking so many problems and very importantly when you uh, work in the strategic level in tomorrow's um, uh, market and job field or even business field then you need to know then how to critically think okay say one stakeholder you're doing a business with one stakeholder and then and everything is going all right but you have to think always critically if if my stakeholder do something like that or, or uh, do some other things to you or something else or uh, something critically okay you have to think about the macro situation or micro situation okay if my team members uh, will regret me okay or when my resources will not uh, you know start flowing to me or uh, if you have a lack of people uh, skilled people what you can do and that is how then what is that this is called i always used to say in the uh, in, in the classroom then do the plan a plan b and plan c um always think about the alternative backup plan and even even if you can if you're watching a movie and then you will find the, the actor is always thinking about okay i will try to grab this villain right this way but he failed the plan and then what will be the plan b so exactly in the business field then you have to do your plan b and plan c if possible and you have to do it to get the immediate success so that you will not be disheartened when plan a is actually will not work but if you have only one plan and it will not work then you have to see it again together and then it will take so much time to have a making a plan b that's why you have to create before you starting the works okay and you have to have the quality of adaptability and we often uh, write in our resume that i have a tremendous adaptability but often we found this is a wrong statement provided by an individual you have to have it um, that means the environment uh, it's not like an HR environment, I'm talking about the working environment. So your working environment may not liked by you, but uh, may not as you thought. And so, but you have to match, you have to adapt with this environment as quick as possible. Like whenever I used to uh, face interview in any, any interview board, then I used to say, I can pick the environment very quickly. I'm a quick learner how and then i have to show them a proof that okay that is how i uh, adapt the environment very quickly so that's how you can develop yourself and organizations and then you have to organize yourself how to do it and that is like whenever you read a planning chapter in management and that probably your teachers already taught it to you even if you have like a 10 minutes and then you have to think about like even maybe you have to spend like a five minutes for planning and then you have to work five minutes. If you start working in the very fast minute, okay, if you think like we have only 10 minutes and then probably it will not work. 
So that's why the planning is everything. Uh, just I'm giving another example. Say the cricketer and batsman, whenever a ball, uh, you know, bowled by a bowler like a hundred kilometer. So it's like a 22 years. So what is a fraction second or nanoseconds that a batsman is getting. But batsman, whenever I see the delivery and, and he judge, himself or herself like okay the ball might be like in swinger or out swinger or something like this okay what will be the length and other things and then whenever delivery goes on and then and he or she got, um, is getting like only a few seconds a few nanoseconds and then within the second a fraction of time they have to spend like a planning then how to play this shot exactly the same way even if you have like five minutes if you have five seconds you have to think two seconds and uh, in compared to the five second. So you have to organize yourself, uh, then you will get the, the more accurate success. Don't think, okay, I have a less time, then I can start working very fast, but then you, you, you cannot do everything on time. Exception cannot be an example again. So sometimes it clicks, sometimes it not click. And then willingness to learn always, even till death. I myself, still I think I don't know anything because uh, though uh, I spent my 35 years, uh, because my, I lost my father in early career, so I told this story to everybody because of uh, my father uh, uh, death and then what happened, then we have to uh, come to the real life situation. So it started like a, uh, a long time. So last 30 years I'm working in the field and then I found that um, there are so many challenges and so many things I'm learning every day. Don't think you know so many things and it will actually uh, the make a more problem. If you think you know everything and then that you, it, is, it is a problem, it is a problem. Always think you're a learner. Whenever you meet some people, you're working somewhere else and try to grab the unknown things. Okay, try to know the other thing. So, and then also you have to have some empathy, empathy uh, um, qualities. So. The thing is that there are so many of like subsequent such Google. We didn't have Google. You are so lucky. You have a Google, you have a wiki, you have a YouTube, you have so many, so many, so many things you have LinkedIn. So use these free resources, believe me, spend time. Don't stick uh, on like in like a Facebook or social media so, so long. It will destroy you. Okay. Uh, once you are in a position, maybe you can have a, like a, some uh, additional time to do that. So do this, but you know, having a limit. And nowadays, a smartphone has like uh, what is called screen timing. Uh, so you can analyze the screen time at the day end whenever you went to sleep. And then, okay, you found, okay, you spent four hours um, uh, in front of the screen. And then you found and you spent four, three hours, 45 minutes in social media. Just think about yourself. Is it? Is it the way then you will develop yourself? So who is the liable for that? You are the liable. So don't think, oh, and, and, and don't think, don't expect that people will be spoon feeding you. Is spoon feeding time gone, okay? Because spoon feeding time is like a year one and two. Then your parents were like running behind of you to feed yourself. Not now, no, nobody will do that. I'm doing thankless job because I love you, the guys. But believe me, uh, you have to create your own world. You have to create your unique features. You, this is your time uh, because you are undergrad or postgrad, whatever the level you have. So you can see so many people, those who are uh, in a good shape, good positions, they follow them, what quality they have. And then uh, you, act, you just try to adopt their best quality uh, to you, uh, adopt um, uh, those quality. Um, um, within your uh, features, and then you will see you will be something unique. So that is very important. So another thing, if I summarize this again, the hard skills versus the soft skills. Um, uh, you know, uh, the hard skills, and nowadays the people are looking for certificate. There are plenty, plenty of, of resources. Just Google it. What kind of certification you want? If you look for supply chain management, marketing, digital marketing, accounting management, whatsoever, entrepreneurial things. So just think about. It. You need to have like a degree of certification, free certification. And I would like to request you if there is an even twenty dollar, fifty dollar, thirty uh, uh, expenditure, just try to 
Yeah, in our time, we didn't have any credit card around us, so we failed to grab something, uh, even if, if we wanted to. But um, nowadays, it's very easy. Uh, everybody has the credit card. And so many people will help you to do that. Don't waste your money. And uh, uh, we, I often see that yeah, many students are uh, going to the restaurant and spending a lot of, uh, so uh, control your expenditure if you don't have enough money and then you just convert this expenditure. If you spend like a hundred dollars, like 8,000 uh, or so, you can save this money and, and go for a certification. And this certification will help you, believe me. And, and so I say, in our time, the computer was the new things in our country. So what I think that I, I never go to the any uh, uh, you know um, uh, uh, training center. I'm sorry for that. <laughs> the training center to learn MS Word, Excel. So what I did, I just uh, push my family then uh, give me a computer, and so I experiment uh, and the things I learned. I, I learned network by myself, uh, and my friends helped me. Uh, and so, and I, I tried to develop soft and hard skills through the computer. On that time, your search engine was there. It's a very limited facilities, but still, I got a lot of help on that time. I'm talking about uh, 1993, four, um, five, six. So your type speed is another type of speed is another thing. You will get a lot of advantage. You can do the things more promptly. Multitasking ability can be applied. So people think, oh, what kind of ability? I'm not a type. I'm not going to be a typewriter. <laughs> it's not a matter of you're not going to be a typewriter or not. It's a matter of you how fast you can do the work. Okay, that is important. I try to learn something, uh, basic computer programming, HTML, XML, and this is a very easy one. Just search like how to learn this, and it's very easy. It's not that complicated, but it will give you. And uh, try and, and learn something like uh, how to develop, a, uh, um, how, to, how to design a very good template of like a PowerPoints and all this. It will give you, because the world is uh, based on the presentation nowadays, believe me. It's an answer based on the presentation. So whenever bosses will call you, they will not ask you straight away, what is your plan? Then they will tell you then, okay, show, show your plan. And so the lucrative way you present, the visible, uh, the feasible way you will present, the realistic way you can present, then you will be successful later tomorrow. You'll be a successful manager. So again, in a nutshell, and soft skill again, and interpersonal skill, what I call the good communication skill, you have to have a flexibility. Don't be harsh, don't be rude, don't be like Steve. Okay, I'm not like a, uh, uh, whatever I told and this is the final, no. You have to always flexible. You, you have to learn to say, uh, you have to uh, like an equivalent um, quality of apologizing, apologizing uh, to the people, towards the people that, okay, if you do some mistake and then you can frequently, um, easily, say that okay i apologize and people has an ego problems sometimes you know that that these methods are better than you but you never uh, praise them just think about and uh, if you have like a 20 teachers in your university and maybe 19 uh, are uh, you know um, good but one is bad and that you are talking about one in 90 percent time even 99 percent time and very occasionally, one person time you're talking about your good teachers. So that is the things and people has a, like a complexity in his mind. People has not the openness, they have a closed mind. So it will not help you to be a good team member, okay? So, and there are so many things I can, can because it's time to go, I have something to do. So uh, there is like a time management, it is very important, again. So you might have a task, uh, and you have given like a one hour of time that you need to know how to finish in one hour. The same job, if you have given like a half an hour, then you need to know how to do this. So that means the more time you'll get, the more accuracy you should have, and um, the things will should be the more, uh, you know, uh, a better way than others. Yeah. So again, these are the things that you have to learn always. Uh, try to learn something new and focus on what is happening all over the world, the field you are working, especially don't look everything you are working in supply chain, you are looking for what is happening in the biology and chemistry. 
no need for them you might have a, like a additional knowledge to okay what is happening in the world and and how people are going to the moon or mars so that is the different story but you should not spend so like um, hours of time to that so whatever are you and this is the things and so you need to know how to adapt yourself within the diversity don't stick on the particular religions or regional things and be open again okay so then you need to know then you are uh, you are a student today and tomorrow you will act like a teacher even if you're not teacher you are a manager tomorrow so you will deal like a 20 people so you will be a teacher of that 20 people how to do the things so believe me it will help you so again, um, the questions you asked, uh, this is a very critical situation of COVID-19. Uh, we all are staying at home, especially uh, I myself uh, at home like eight weeks, though I went to the shopping for several times. And we are working here uh, informally. You know, that's why my environment and atmosphere is very informal. Uh, so today is uh, the video I'm recording is uh, April 28th. Um, so we are, uh, uh, we started staying at home like it's 12 uh, hours. March um, uh, 1 or so. So uh, we don't know what will, will be a situation, but believe me, uh, if it is prolonged uh, like a couple of months, the economic situation will be bad. If economic situation will be bad, the job market will be called bad, the business will be bad. It will, uh, uh, it will need some time to overcome. So the people are looking for, the students are looking for job, they will be in trouble. So the more qualified people will get the job and less qualified people will be, uh, you know, will not manage any job probably. So that's why be competitive. Uh, uh, so uh, to be competitive, again, you need to have these kind of skills. Uh, so there is like a Google Garage or like there are so many books or uh, Udemy. And if you search Google, uh, then you'll find so many uh, authority, those who are uh, this time, they're giving you the free certifications um, having like uh, the free courses and all this. So I wish you all the best. And so always search Google. Even um, if you're confused about the color and then ask what color it is. Um, and just try to speak uh, with the Google all the time. And because you need not to type all the time, you can speak to Google, okay? What is, what is it? And then, and obviously you have to choose the right one. There will be millions of, um, um, you know, link will come up whenever you are asking a question, but choose the right one based on your merit. So your merit will be developed based on your effort. So if you sleep like 16 hours, nobody can help you, okay? Um, don't sleep less and don't work like a, uh, uh, overnight waking up is not, uh, will not help you. So try to be a disciplined person, uh, which will help tomorrow. Um, I can guarantee you, if you work like only two to three hours a day, you will be a champion tomorrow, okay? So uh, even I personally didn't uh, give enough time to develop myself, but um, Allah is almighty. So uh, whatever I did, I'm happy so far. So, um, because again, I'm, I'm making these videos informally in this COVID-19 situations. I'm sorry that I'm not a formal uh, situation. I'm not, I'm not uh, too ease up with the like the video blogging or so. I do not like it. I write a lot of things in my Facebook, whatever I feel. Uh, you can follow my Facebook and so that you can uh, have an idea of what kind of things uh, is going on in my head, what kind of person I am. And so probably there are so many requests as coming to make videos, uh, but I'm not comfortable. It's still not that much comfortable, but probably I'll do a couple of, uh, if you are keep requesting me. And so this is also a learning process and that's how the things are going up. So we are taking classes, we are taking everything, but uh, to make a video for Bangladeshi students or some other part of the students, um, I, I do not think that um, I have that kind of skills and they're, they're, they're so skillful people sir, uh, in LinkedIn and Facebook or other social media and they're delivering uh, uh, very uh, wisely 
so I think um, you can hire um, uh, a, 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 as much as the videos or uh, read the things so that you will learn the things. And so I hope then if you have an, uh, put an effort, then you will learn something, believe me. Then put an effort, don't sleep a uh, long time, like you wake up like at 10 a.m. and then, uh, and then you said, okay, this is the midday, or oh, what shall I do? Then I will do something in the night, and the night time you will find friends, and then you are spending time with the friends, and then the day is gone. So keep some time for you every day, whenever you go to sleep, and I go to the bed, and then you are asking yourself what I learned today. Even a single word will help you. Even nothing, uh, if it is nothing, and then it will not help you in future believe me so world is getting compared so good luck everyone um, I hope this video will help you to judge uh, you know what to do or what not to do so again uh, uh, always try to uh, be in learning situations and read something uh, watch something good and then you will learn something thank you